Last week on Total Drama Island, those good-for-nothing campers got swept away by a rainstorm that left them stranded on a deserted island. Meanwhile, the chubby one drifted ashore in his outhouse and made a new friend who has an IQ almost as high as his. The gruesome chick built a raft for her and the delinquent, which left now the girl to bend for herself. Somehow they all ended up together in the treehouse confessing they seen. That's when they came up with a crackerjack plan to find out who was making the fire. But all they found was the secret location of our production crew camp. Yeah, it's me doing the recap. You got a problem with that? Since Chris is our host of the crew crew award show, I'm filling in his host. And guess what? I ain't happy about it either. To sit back, zip it, and watch tonight's episode of Total Drama Island. Mom and Dad, I'm doing fine. You guys are on my mind. You asked me what I wanted to be, and now I think the answer is plain to see. I wanna be famous. I wanna live close to the sun. Oh, pack your bags, cause I've already won. Everything to prove, nothing in my way. I'll get there one day. swimming in the shark infested water. Here's how it works. Team one, delinquent and chubby. Team two, grim and grimmer. Everything you need is in these bags. You'll navigate your way north to base camp. The first team to tag the camp totem pole wins. And here's a tip. Better set up camp before sundown, because once nightfall hits, you won't even see your trembling hand in front of your terrified face. Unless, you got night vision goggles, but you don't. <laughs> oh, please, please don't leave us here. I'm begging you. We won't survive. Grab a hold of your gut, soldier. Duncan's a lot of things, but he is definitely not a chicken. He's up to something, I can tell. And I am going to find out what it is. This is totally bonkers. We'll be scarfed down by a grizzly. Oh, I wouldn't worry about that. You wish you saw a grizzly once you meet up with old Sasquatch and Aqua. He's one mean mama jamma. Get up, troops! Try not to die! This is illegal! You can't do this! Hey, Peaches, file it with the network lawyers. Where do they think they're going? They can't survive out there. It's suicide. It's... Hey, I got an idea. Let's see what happens if you close it already. Okay, nothing would give me greater pleasure than ditching her grim little butt in the middle of nowhere, but this is the wild. I need someone to shove in front of me if a bear comes by. I gotta say, I was jazzed to be paired with Owen. I mean, come on. If you were a grizzly, who'd you rather be dipping in barbecue sauce? Where are we going? I just wanted to get away from the girls. Psych them out a bit, you know? Okay, 
Let's see what we got. Yep, yep. It's all good except one thing's missing. What was that? We're gonna die out here! We'll be out of the woods in no time thanks to these babies. You stole those from Chef? Sweet! What can I say? I'm a hardened criminal. These babies we can see as clear as day. <laughs> awesome. Let me see those. Oh, my eyes! I've been blinded! All right, that's enough. We've got a challenge to win. Now grab the map while I figure out where we are. Sure. But the map isn't much use without a compass, is it? <laughs> okay. The sun rose from the east, which means that's north. So camp is that way. Are you sure? I think the sun rose from over there, which means the camp is that away. Uh, yeah, I think you're wrong. We're going this way. Let's move. Uh. Camp is north, so we just follow the river. Easy. Yeah, as long as we're not munched by Sasquatchamacallit. Would you relax? That's obviously just another stupid made-up myth to scare us. I don't believe in Sasquatches. I don't. And they wouldn't, like, drop us here in the middle of the forest if there really was one. What if we died? Would they? <sighs> I kill for some bug spray. These mosquitoes think I'm an all-you-can-eat buffet. I think a mosquito bit the inside of my throat. Oh, it itches. <laughs> okay, I can't believe I'm saying this, but I think I actually miss Chris. Anything is better than Chef's psychopath. Why do camp cooks always look like escape criminals? Can you hear me, Chris? I hope you enjoyed your little day off while we put up with your psychotic sidekick, who, by the way, wasn't even doing anything. He just ditched us in the woods. <laughs> Did you catch what Chef said about the Sasquatch and Aqua? That really freaked me out. Did you know that some people think Bigfoot is the missing link between humans and monkeys? Really? I'd say the missing monkey is right here. Ow! No, I'm serious. Witnesses say he's eight feet tall, 400 pounds, and has B.O. that'd make you hurl chunks from like 200 yards. <laughs> Come on. If he really existed, don't you think somebody would have caught him by now? Nah, he's crafty. Hey, hey, it's the girls. And they're going the wrong way. Typical chicks with zero sense of direction. Hey, here's a pointer. Try checking a map. We would if we had one, but this compass tells us that's north. You know, like where Chef said the camp is. Oh. Enjoy the view up there, losers! Great, now we're behind. We'll just have to jump and dive into the river. After my big cliff dive on the first day at camp, I was king of the world. I'm going to die now. I'm going to totally die now. I conquered my biggest fear and helped my team win. It was awesome. Come on, big guy. Yeah! Oh! Ah! Ah! <laughs> But then, a few days later, my fear came gurgling back up like a day-old Indian buffet. Oh, no. Uh, I don't do daredevil dives anymore. Been there, done that. No can do. Then no worries. I'll do it for you. Ah! OK, 
Okay, look, we both know we don't like each other, and we both probably wish we could push each other off a cliff right now. The thought had crossed my mind. But I think we can also agree that we have to win this challenge. We can't afford to let the guys win invincibility. And who knows what kind of evil bonding they're up to right now. Nice one. Oh, oh extra points for the stink factor. <laughs> so we're a team on this, right? Right. <gasps> they're getting, getting away! away. <laughs> Using the river was brilliant. Well played, boys. Well played. <laughs> our supplies. Never underestimate a known criminal. Ew. I hope we find the camp soon. You really stink. You should talk. I can smell your armpits from here. <gasps> Heather, look! It's a Sasquatch footprint. Oh, I'm so scared. Elise, you're embarrassing yourselves. Mr. Squirrel. And hello to you, Mr. Raccoon. Oh, good day, Mr. Sasquatch and Aqua. Safe. I never thought I'd say this, but please tell me that tongue in my ear is Owen. No, that would be the bad. Do Sasquatches get meaner at night? I don't know, but I don't really want to find out. and a map, I guess you beat us. Uh, speak for yourself. 
It's obvious they kicked our butt. Fine, whatever. You beat us. Uh, look, if you guys want to bunk with us, it's cool. Why don't you uh, set up camp while we look for firewood? Ugh, the damsel in distress thing made me want to puke. Shh, who cares? Let them think they're big, strong boys for now. It's so easy to fool guys. They're like little kids. They never see it coming. I've got to admit, just when I think Heather can't get more underhanded, she gets more underhanded. Toying with the boys. Well played. You really think we can trust them with our stuff back there? As if. Trust no one. Hey, I smooshed the energy bars into a big chewy ball. Any takers? No, but I'll take your sleeping bag. Think? I can't sleep. I'm too scared. Can I just... Uh, yeah. Sure. I feel so safe in your arms. You won't fall asleep, right? Yep, you can count on it. Dude, wake up! The fire, the girls, our stuff, it's gone! What? Oh, the map! <laughs> Do we feel bad? No way. They stole our stuff first. All is fair in love and war. And this is definitely war now. Okay, that was so much fun. I just wish I could have seen the looks on their faces. And for the record, Gwen was just as into scamming them as I was. Oh, I can't believe I let myself get suckered by a chick. Uh, two chicks. What can I say? You're weak. You've succumbed to the primal urges of all... Do you smell that? What? It's sweet. And cinnamony. And I've almost got it. Sticky buns. That's some oven loving. Hold on, baby. I'm coming for ya. No, no, wait. We made it. Oh, crud. Ah, go for it, dude. Sticky buns. Oh, no. <laughs> So close, why? Well, they're fresh from the oven. Those are mine! I was looking forward to those buns. All right, game's over. Girls win, guys lose. We lost the challenge for a few sticky buns? What was that? Do you know how many sticky buns I could have bought with $100,000? <laughs> OMG, that was so pathetic. I hope those buns were worth it. Wow. We kind of scored that one. I think Duncan's really mad at me. Maybe I should have saved him a sticky bun. This was supposed to be my day. I had it all planned. I was going to eat my sticky bun Whoa. and relax with one of Heather's facials <gasps> while I finished reading Gwen's diary and clean my toenails. That reminds me, you need to sharp this. <laughs> the rest of own snacks day. Oh. But you all ruined it! So, here's your incense and darnability. out of here and back to Juvie. At least with convicts, you know what to expect. Left, 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 right, left. Come on, soldier. Do I bear a striking resemblance to somebody who's got all day? What can I say? You had the chance to rock an alliance with me, but you blew it. You played the game well. 
Sorry you had to lose over sticky buns. Hi. Whatever. So, looks like we made it to the final three. I just want to thank everyone who got me to the final three. Courtney, I feel your pain, girl. You should not have been cheated off like that. Noah, you are one seriously smart guy. Don't think I didn't notice. And Lindsay, the most fashionable girl on the island next to me, you know you'll always be one of my BFFs. I've got to admit, I didn't think I'd make it this far. <sighs> but now that I have, I might as well win. Sue, it's Owen and two cool girls. <laughs> Bar day! Just get me out of this place. 